I am Katalin Pakosti, and I'm the new Chief R&D Officer of East Seed. I'm joining the company um, in this August, and uh, I will be replacing Simon Yan after 40 years, which is probably a very, very big change for the group and the family, and I'm very excited and very delighted to be with the uh, East Seed family. I would be a yacht on being long, thin, and flexible. If I would be a vegetable, I would be a sweet corn because sweet corn is highly adopted. I traveled around in many countries in the world and I lived in a couple of uh, countries as well. And I feel that I'm always finding my ground no matter where I'm going. So I think that uh, uh, something really describes me. I also think that a good uh, corn plant is uh, sturdy and able to withstand the strong winds and recover. And I associate that with uh, uh, integrity and resiliency, which I think are two key important traits for a leader. And um, perhaps last but not least, um, corn is nutritious and delicious. It's good for human. And I think when it comes to people, there is so many good things to be done. So I think uh, th those are all, you know, standing for who I am, what I am standing for. And um, yeah. A sweet corn it is. <laughs>
interview with uh, Simon, I believe, uh, um, uh, was uh, last year around November, December time. And my first impression was uh, uh, of him that he's a plant builder by heart. It's maybe a little bit something difficult to explain, but um, Simon was uh, um, very reserved, very, very thoughtful, at the same time curious. And I felt, you know, that he's, I really, really immensely felt that connection, you know, that I can really, really relate to these questions because I knew where they are coming from. And I also empathize with him because I cannot imagine how hard it can be to recruit for your replacement. And uh, many, many times since then, I thought about it, you know, that life always, you know, throws some fun facts at you or, you know, brings you to some funny situations. But I thought that um, as things goes around, turn around, <laughs> um, one day probably it's going to come to me that, you know, I will need to do the same. So I promised uh, that I will be really, really cool because he was cool. <laughs> What was your first impression of Kat? Uh, my first impression was that uh, Kat is a good people person and a good team leader. And I'm sure she will be. Uh, my advice would be this. We often see what we, what we want or what we expect to see. If you change the way you look at things, the things you look at will change. Anybody who's working in science, and especially for the young generation, um, I would advise them to be curious. Um, I think curiosity takes you to horizons you've never been, to explore, to learn, um, be humble about it, and just open your mind because there are tremendous opportunities out there when it comes to science. Network and learn from others as much as from the growers. It's always bringing some new ideas which can be implemented and uh, drive to innovation. Um, never give up on your dreams and do not limit yourself. Um, and trust your instincts when it comes to uh, science. Most of the time you are right. <laughs>